the idea with everything that we created was it was a brand and ultimately with the way we've tried to make it quite a stylish brand I guess like for example you probably noticed the, the logo design is a bit Coke bottle like that was the inspiration for that and that sort of 50s diner theme kind of came into the mix. The main thing we're trying to do uh, just to sort of stay ahead of the game if you like and to add our own individual touch is to kind of engage people a bit more and um, offer more of an experience. We've got games on offer, board games. Very much the man versus foods challenge was something that we thought students um, would, would get involved with and uh, I think a lot of the people taking the challenge so far have been students. The waffle challenge is four waffles stacked with four scoops of ice cream um, and some various other bits and pieces thrown in. I think there's that kind of wall that you hit when there's that much chocolate and dairy product in there and I think the, the way I'm looking at it now is the, the, the snail wins the race. Everybody who's wolfed it down and looks like they're going to finish you know, in minutes kind of gets that last little section of waffle goes, no, no it's not going to happen. More and more we want to work with our customers and uh, we want to really gauge what people want and then work um, to sort of diversify in those directions. And yeah, we're looking to do sort of certain evenings where students will get a bigger discount, um, themed evenings as well. So, uh, as well as using the video game consoles for, um, to run some competitions. Yeah, we do try and do anything for a customer. If we've got the product, we can create very freely. You know, we can create lots of different flavours, we rotate them weekly anyway, so there's always an opportunity for someone to create something new when they come in, and it's quite nice they can just come and go, oh, I'll have a shake, what do you do? All of this, you choose.